Hello and welcome back to the channel. Today we have an update on the Tom Clancy's The Division Universe. Okay, uh, hello everyone. I'm reading directly from the Ubisoft site here. When we launched Tom Clancy's The Division in 2016, the team at Ubisoft Massive and all of our studios around the world had high ambitions for what was then the first completely original IP under the Tom Clancy umbrella since 2009. Not to mention, it was also an ambitious game unlike anything Ubisoft had produced before. Thanks to you, our fans, the reception to the division exceeded our expectations, breaking multiple Ubisoft records. You continued showing phenomenal support in the years since, playing with and against each other across major post-launch content for the original game. You also came along with us for the highly anticipated launch of The Division 2, making it one of the most successful games of 2019 and its 2020 expansion, The Division 2 Warlords of New York, the most active in the game's history. Through all of this, you have created an incredible community of over 40 million players setting the franchise on an expanding trajectory that now includes more games and more transmedia content set within The Division universe that we're unveiling today. While work continues on The Division 2, other Ubisoft teams have been exploring additional ways to introduce The Division to even more players. Today, we're pleased to share that Tom Clancy's The Division Heartland, a free-to-play game set in The Division universe, is in development at our Red Storm studio. And of course, Red Storm, the original uh, dev or dev team that worked on the original uh, Rainbow Six games. Having worked on Tom Clancy's games since 1997, its extensive experience across numerous genres and games, most recently The Division and The Division 2, makes Red Storm a perfect fit for this project. Heartland is a standalone game that doesn't require previous experience with the series, but will provide an all new perspective on the universe in a new setting. The game will be made available in 2021 to 2022 on PC, consoles, and the cloud. Those interested in participating can uh, access or sign up for early test phases. Heartland isn't the only new game in development. The Division will also be coming to mobile platforms for the very first time, bringing the universe to an even wider audience. We'll have more details on this exciting project at a later date. As previously announced, Brand new content will be coming to The Division 2, with development led by Ubisoft Massive and support from Ubisoft Bucharest. While it's still too early to discuss any specific details, this update will include an entirely new game mode for The Division franchise and new methods for leveling your agents with an emphasis on increasing build variety and viability. We look forward to revealing more later this year ahead of this content's late 2021 release. So we have new Division content coming late 2021, uh, a new free-to-play mode called Heartland, and if that's not enough, we also have the Division film in development with Netflix. Okay. So some exciting things coming from the Division. Um, a new free-to-play game called Heartland, the Division Heartland, is coming at some point. Um, also, new content for The Division 2, the main game, is another expansion is coming. So, peace out guys, I'm really excited to actually hear that and learn that they're still creating more content for The Division 2. Um, it sounds like, obviously, a new free-to-play game, once again, The Division Heartland, not to mention new content for the actual Division 2 game coming. So, uh, we have a novel coming as well, a mobile experience, and a Netflix film. So. Uh, as a Division fan, I'm really excited about that. Um, it's definitely going to be some awesome stuff. Uh, so yeah, there it is, guys. The Division Heartland, a free-to-play Division uh, spin-off game or, or game set in the Division universe coming from Ubisoft and Red Storm Studio. So I will update the channel with more info on that when possible. And uh, get out there and sign up for that early access. Peace out, guys. Catch you next time.